I'm here at Grays Court to show you what you can do with those lovely pine cones that you foraged on your winter walks. Well, they make great Christmas decorations, and today I'm going to show you how to make this little fellow a pine cone mouse. So, for this, you'll need a little pine cone, a big pine cone, one acorn cup, some glue, some brown and white paint, paint brushes, twine or a bendy stick, and a pair of scissors. So to make the ears, you just pull off two scales from your larger pine cones and if they're a little bit long, then just trim the ends. Uh, and then you just need to paint those brown. That's the background of your, of your ear. And then around the inside, you want to create like a half moon shape in white paint on top. Once they're dry, you can stick those right onto your smaller pine cone. But I like to place them quite close together and they're going to go just behind the face of your mouse. So once you've got the right position, just stick them on and leave them to dry. So now it's time for your little mouse's charming face. You just need a tiny touch of brown paint. And you start with his nose. And it's really easy to find the nose because there's a point just on the edge of the acorn cup there. And I love this bit because you get to give your mouse his character or her character. So then you just need two little dots for eyes. And then I'm going to give him a cheeky little smile as well. And once that's dry, you can glue it and stick it right in front of the ears, just like that. And now we're going to do the tail. So you can use twine for this and you just need to measure out how long you want the tail to be. Um, you could even use a bendy twig if you wanted to and you just need to wind that around your finger to get the shape really. But today we're using twine so cut it to the length you want, pop a bit of glue on the end and a little bit of glue on the back of the pine cone and then press it together. Okay, so there we are and it's finished. So the only thing left to do now is to name your mouse and find somewhere to put him. I hope this has inspired you to make your own Christmas mouse. And there are plenty more things that you can do with pine cones. And if you want something really quick and easy to do or you're waiting for your mouse to dry, you can make these pine cone Christmas trees. Just paint them green and stick on some pom-poms or little jingle bells. Great for young children. Thank you.